Hi everyone, this is Aaron for Zolo Tech. We're going to do a first setup of the new Nexus 7. Google improved all these specs, and this is Android 4.3, so I thought I'd walk you through the first setup. Now, I can't increase the screen brightness any more than I have. I've kind of moved the light away so it's not directly on here until I can increase it a little bit later. So we've got the welcome screen. We can select a language. We'll select English, United States for me. We'll hit next. Now it wants me to select Wi-Fi. This is my Wi-Fi and I'll put in the password. I have a very long Wi-Fi password, but I'll connect. Should take just a moment. And now it says I have a system update. And I knew there would be a system update immediately following the first setup. So it's going to power off, shutting down it says. A little bit alarming if you've never set up one of these tablets to just have it power off just like that. It'll reboot. At least it gave us a heads up that there was a system update. It's installing the system update. I was very impressed at how fast the new Nexus 7 boots up with that quad-core Qualcomm Snapdragon S4 processor. It's incredibly fast, it seems. It's rebooting. We'll wait for it to boot up here. I believe there's two separate updates. We can see there's the little Nexus symbol. We're back at the welcome screen. We'll hit next. I guess I have to put my password back in. We're connecting to Wi-Fi. You can see it's connected. It asks if I have a Google account. Say yes. Now after I hit next, after putting in my Google information, it's asking me if I want to use the backup services and location services, and in this case I do. So I'll hit next. Hit next. It's going to restore my previous settings that I use on my Nexus 4 or different Android devices, and it's going to bring all that back to the tablet. I've got my name in there, and the setup is complete. So let's see if we can turn this up first. All right, I've turned the brightness up. You can see it's quite bright. I have some stock things here that says this is your Google Play library. Go back home, recommended for you. I've got our app drawer here. This screen looks quite nice. I can tell already it's nice and vibrant. The brightness is not all the way up. If I go to brightness, you can see I'll turn it all the way up. Turn it back down. Overall, it looks really nice, but that's pretty much the first setup. You've got a couple different things you can do. You can just drag the app drawer or the drawer down for notifications. And then we've got our apps down here. So I'll be using this for the next few days before I do a full review. And I'll be doing some other videos as well. But if you have any questions or comments regarding the new Nexus 7, please place those in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. This is Aaron. I'll see you next time.